So today we're going to talk about tattoo. No, I did not get a tattoo. Hello family. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. And guys, thank you so much for your support. And don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share this video with everyone. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you will receive notification whenever I post videos. And also don't forget to give it a like. All right, are we cool? All right, so today we're gonna to talk about tattoo. No, I did not get a tattoo. We're talking about eyebrow tattoo sticker. So these are eyebrow tattoo sticker. They've been around for a while and I did purchase it either on Instagram or Amazon. I'm pretty sure I purchased them on Amazon. So these are um, 4D hair-like stickers. So I'm in the color brown and black. There are six sheets. Actually, no, this one has 18 sheets. And within that 18 sheets, there are 66 total of pair of brows. They come in the color black and they also come in the color brown. They are waterproof. Um, once you put them on, they are waterproof. They're supposed to last to seven days. Once you put them on, they're supposed to stay on. You can wash your face, do everything you want to do, and they're not supposed to come off. So we're going to try them out. So they're, they are in a different shape based on the shape of your brows. You can find each one that fits your brows and they come in pairs, have the same set of brows. Hopefully they will match depending on how you position it. You're gonna need a beauty blender or a cotton swab and you need some water and we need scissors. Let's get started. This is the front as kind of like a, a plastic that covers the sticky part. And then on the back, these are the images. They don't have numbers on this one. Um, they have brown, black, and the different shape. I'm going through each one to make sure that I can find one that matches my brow. And we'll see how this is gonna work. Yeah, I think this is more like me, <laughs> but a little bit thicker. Or maybe this one, more me. So I'm gonna try it out and see how it looks. I'm gonna try this one. Because for some reason, it looks like the bottom one seems to be thinner than the top one. And it goes from thicker to thinner. So I'm going to try this first one down at the bottom. Make sure it's the same length of my brows. I'm going to cut them out. So, um, let me make sure that they're even. Okay, this looks pretty good. So, and then I'm gonna take my cotton ball, remove this sticker, and then this is, this part here is sticky, and that's the part that you place on your brows. And I, on, no, let me shape it. Okay, so I'm gonna take it, place it right here, Make sure that it's covering my brows and then just rub it, rub it. And then I'm gonna take my cotton swab, I'm gonna dip it in the water. I'm gonna start dabbing. I'm gonna dab it. I'm gonna dab it. Oh, make sure that it's, so I'm gonna dab it. What did I do? Okay, it's sliding. Uh-oh, I might have to redo this one. It's, is it sticky already? Okay, are you guys ready? Looks like I moved it around, moved it a little bit, so I might have to Redo it. 
Hopefully I don't have to dab it, dab it. Are you ready? I am ready. Okay, here we go. Okay. Okay. Not bad at all. What do you guys think? It's a little bit higher. Yeah, it's kind of high. It's a little bit too high right here. I should have brought it down. So... Can I remove it? What do you think? Okay, let's try the other one. Maybe I can get the other one positioned better. Look. <laughs> and now I'm going to try to position it correctly on my brows. So we start, this is my brows. And this is the, um, no, you know what? my arched. I think this is where I can't see where my arch is. Okay. There's my arch. There's my, this is where my hair starts. And make sure it's positioned on top of the hair. And let's add a bit more water. Let's start damping from here. Damp, dab, dab. This one doesn't look too bad. The only thing is it's a little bit higher, but it looks like hair. The only thing is it's shiny. All right, we're all damp, ready to go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here we go. Let's peel it. Okay. This one turned out better. I was afraid that it wasn't going to turn out. Okay. Hmm. Can you damp it a little bit? This one turned out better. Can you see? This one, I think it's a little bit higher. I could fix that. What do you guys think? This side turned out really good. Okay. I take a little bit of my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm going to dab a little bit and put it over top because they say it's supposed oh, to take away the shine and okay, let me try this side maybe I need to redo this one this one looks okay. What do you guys think? It doesn't look too bad. Take this off. This one off. How do I take it off? Okay. Because I want to redo this one. This one looks okay. I'm going to use my Garnier Skin Active. What is this one? This is the waterproof eye makeup remover. And try to remove this one and then redo it. So it comes off with waterproof eye makeup remover. Okay, so we got this one all cleaned out. Let's try it again. This one seems to be okay. No. All right, so let's try another one. I'm still going to stick with the same, the same one down at the bottom. I'm going to cut it out. Remove the sticker. Okay, let's clean up my brows. I don't want to have any any residue. And I'm going to position it right. I'm going to start from here and then just 
dab it. Is it down? Okay. Take the sponge and then just okay. Ah, oh, okay. This one came out much better. All right. Okay. Take my beauty blender and then just dab over it. Dab it. But I think as as time goes by, it should work. I'll do this one and then we'll come back. All right guys, so here's the second one. It doesn't look as bad. I think I positioned it a little bit better than the first time I did it. The only thing is the shine. I think this concept is great if you're one who doesn't like to do your brows or you have a hard time doing your brows, I think this is a great concept. For me, the only thing I can't get past is the shine. Since this one came out really good. Really well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead my face and then come back and then give you guys my honest opinion on this. So don't go away. Stick around. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I am back full face. And what do you think about the brows? I think they turned out pretty good. I did put a little bit of concealer around the top, blended in really well. The only thing is they're darker than I'm used to, but they turn out really well. I think with a little bit of patience and trying to line it up correctly, you can get the perfect brows, which I think I did. Like the only thing I'm saying is that I normally don't do my brows this dark. Next time I'm gonna try to use the brown. So because I used the black and black was seen to be a little bit dark. This should be like maybe a dark brown. That would be great. So see, I might can get away with using the the brown instead of the the, the black. But then after I you know play around with it, add a little bit of um, more powder and just play around with it to conceal it, it turned out really, really well. I am impressed because at first I was like, ah, it looks like plastic, but it turned out great. Let me know what you think. I like it. I like it. I don't know what it's going to look like once I wash all this makeup off, but now, ah, oh, you know, I can touch it and look at this. Nothing comes out. It's, it's not going anywhere. All right, guys, let me know what you think. So guess who hit a thousand? Yes. I'm at a thousand, I think, thousand fourteen. So I still have a little ways to go. Watch, watch time in order to monetize my channel. But I've hit a thousand, and I just want to say thank you to everyone. And I have some goodies that I want to give away, and also just to say thank you for those of you who have been with me. From the beginning when I started my channel, let me see, August of 2017. I'm actually coming up on an anniversary, but, and I just want to say thank you. I have some goodies I want to give away, so, and I'll let you know what you need to do to get some of the product. I want to choose two subscribers to give some products to, and maybe some other things. So, let me show you what I'm giving away. I'm giving away this dual pack. Regenerous Micro Sculpting Cream Moisturizer in the Cleanser. I'm giving this away. Urban Decay Heat Set. This is, this will be included in the package. And then also I have some brushes. These are some mini brushes. They're small so you can carry with you if you're going on a trip or if you just don't want to carry your big brushes and you just want to carry these little mini brushes. I have a set that I use when I go away. So these are great set of brushes for individuals who want to just like 
you know, Karen went through. Also, I'm giving away this called Nick and Fab. These are highlights, so I'm giving this away. And then also, I'm adding some face mask. It's what it's the new Yes to Tomatoes Clear Skin for your chin. So this will be included and in some other on some other face masks will be included in the box. And then also I'm giving away my Epsi bag. I have quite a few Epsi bags that has some cute products in it. This one is a lip gloss. This one is a cleanser. This one is the Anastasia of Beverly Hill Brow Tint. This is the mini one. And then also this is a, it says Stuck On You Eye Primer. Also this is, what, what else is in here? Um, this is Coco Cabana Cream. And this is a cute little, little sample that you can take with you. I think this is my May, yeah, this is my May 20. All these little goodies are in here. So one person will get this whole package will be included for one person and then also for the next person I plan on giving away a $50 gift card from either Ulta or Sephora for the second second winner. So and all you have to do is you have to be a subscriber, you have to like this video, comment, and then also you have to also go on my Instagram page and like and comment on one of my pictures and I picked the two winners on that following Monday. So giveaway will be run from the length of Sunday to Sunday so seven days. Alright guys thank you so much for for sticking with me and I really appreciate you guys so much because without you this is this channel is nothing. Good evening it may be morning where you are, good morning. It may be afternoon where you are, good afternoon. And guys, have a beautiful, I'm talking about a beautiful and blessed.